Welcome to Gaming or Grumpy, I'm Grumpy Badger, and with me is a very special guest for this Let's Play, my Half Pint! Hello! She's here because, well, I mean, it's dinosaurs, it's Frontier Developments, Jurassic World Evolution. Um, basically, I think about 14 years ago, 12, 14 years ago, I don't know, I feel really old. There was uh, Jurassic Park Operation Genesis and that was wicked fun and from what i've been able to tell this is quite literally just a uh a remake of jurassic park operation genesis you know with some things streamlined uh, you don't build islands completely from scratch but you also uh get to work with the genetic modification which i think that that could be really fun and um uh, so yeah, we're going to be playing and making dinosaurs, huh? Yeah. Yeah? So, you want to say hi? Say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. So, basically, <clears throat> she's going to be helping me out because, to be perfectly honest, she's way better at Minecraft than I am, so she'll probably be a thousand times smarter when it comes to building this as well. Alright, so you ready? Yeah. All right, let's get started. Let's play dinosaurs. Hello, may I say welcome? My name is Dr. Ian Malcolm. You may have heard of me. Well, correction, you should have heard of me, especially now that you're here. So before you are the islands that you need to manage, if you can. The five deaths. Jeez, if only, if only there had been five. Okay, this is as good a place as any to begin. Isla Matanceros. It's relatively stable. Yeah, you can, uh, you can get your feet wet here. And you should, because diving into the deep end of the pool is where the big, angry, hungry things are. And uh, you want to be ready before you try that. I honestly don't know why the character Ian Malcolm would still associate himself with Jurassic Park. I'm Cabot Finch, public relations and crisis management, and I'm here to help you. You'll start by building a Hammond creation lab. His cynicism and stuff. You know, We've already started on an enclosure now. for you. You should just attach it to the side, but watch out for dinosaurs. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Pretty big enclosure. Alrighty. You ready? Yeah. Alright, so we gotta build the enclosure first. Well, the, the Hammond Creation Lab. So the Hammond Creation Lab is bringing worlds from the Jurassic era <clears throat> Bring dinosaurs from the Jurassic era to Jurassic World. The Hammond Creation Lab allows the incubation, modification, and release of dinosaurs into the park. It can be attached directly to enclosure fences. Bloop! So where do you want it? Do you want it right next to the gate or do you want it way over here on the side? Right next to the gate. Right next to the gate? Yeah. This? Yeah. Let's focus on what you're here to do, which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. Actually, Las Cinco Muertes, <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. You'll need to connect it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. Now comes the real test, incubating a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the creation lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. Struthiomimus. <coughs> so. 
do we want to go from frog to bat? Because it lowers the viability, but it increases his lifespan. Yeah, you think it'll be worth the risk? Yeah. You think it'll be worth the risk? Yeah. Okay. Because honestly, we can't really starting out. We can't really afford the uh, <clears throat> the color change. I think it's funny that dinosaurs have paint schemes, huh? Alright, you ready? Yeah. The machinations of the ambitious, undoing extinction, playing with nature's laws. What can possibly go wrong? Come on, Doctor. You know we've learned so much and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Yes, Mr. Finch, yes, the... The last time. There's always a last time. And a next. Alrighty. We're all set. Our first dinosaur. Yep. Struthiomimus. He's a relative of the Gelamimus. He's a bipedal uh, herbivore. Okay. We're releasing. Life, it begins. The most precious moment, the result of incalculable actions and reactions, trials and errors, genetic mutations and unknowable combinations, chaos, all leading to a living, breathing, we rename him? thinking we rename him being, chicken? an entity, He's distinct a chicken? and unique. And or now we, we, you, should just. We name him? Manufacture them. Run fair turkey so, leg. So well done. I guess. Run fair turkey leg. Run fair turkey leg. Run fair turkey leg. <laughs> this is where we'll get our turkey legs from now on. So he's roaming. He's healthy. Everything looks good. Now I do know that he likes to be fairly social, right? So we'll get him some more. Let's see what's going on with the mission stuff. The Hammond Foundation has three main areas of interest. Security, entertainment, and science. I've already nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. Science division for more dinosaur research or entertainment. Get people in the crowd, make some money. Entertainment. Entertainment? Okay, what about security? Do you think the Struthiomimus is a threat to our no. to our visitors? No? I think we're okay? Okay. Let's try entertainment. Hey, I'm Isaac. I've been hearing good things about you. I'm in charge of the entertainment division here. What good is the world's greatest show if no one sees it? Don't answer. That's rhetorical and painfully obvious. What I'm saying is that we need people in our parks. Fill up our facilities with warm bodies. Numbers bring revenue, excitement, and opportunities. So he would like us to build, connect, and power the expedition center. The Expedition Center will allow you to send out dinosaur dig teams across the world in search of dinosaur fossils, the first step towards acquiring dino DNA. Huh. Yep. Okay. Contracts can be requested from the division heads inside the control room. Complete these to increase your reputation and gain additional revenue to keep expanding your park. Expedition Center... So, I was kind of thinking, um, you know, just hear me out, right? What if, so here's the research lab, right? And here's the fossil. So I was thinking, if we could try to figure out... <clears throat> we could figure out a way to get it to fit in here with these guys. I think, I think that would work better. What do you think? Yeah. I don't think it's gonna fit though. Because what I what I like was would be like the idea of having it kind of close by, and then 
ring concerning its So I was kind of wanting to fit the ranger station in there, but I don't think it's going to fit. Huh. Do you think this will be okay? Putting it over there? Because also, how cool would it be to come down off the tram <clears throat> and see the actual paleontologists that go dig up the dinosaurs? Right? How about how about that? Would that be cool? Yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and build it there. So one more thing. Your reputation. Your rep, quote unquote. Keep an eye on it, okay? Yeah. If you have a solid reputation with a division, you're more likely to benefit from them. Financially, I mean. But like life, it's a balancing act. Each division is vying for your attention, and if they don't get it, they tend to take it personally. The entertainment division is taking notice of your success. As your reputation increases with them, so too does the opportunity to tackle more challenging missions. Okay, cool. We have absolutely everything unlocked now. It looks like ish. Now we're going to go check out Island I'm Management. I'm Claire Deering, and I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, I made some mistakes, and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing, and I believe in these dinosaurs. Island management con screen contains an overview Responsible of Responsible management of our animals is key, as is creating a safe environment Check for our visitors. Check your overall island rating, division reputations, and summary of finances. Oh boy. Whoa! <clears throat> Million dollars to make which dinosaur? Ceratosaurus. The big Jurassic meat eater. Ooh. But it's a million bucks. So what do you think? Should we do it or should we hold off? Hold off. Hold off? I don't I don't think we're really quite ready yet for a big meat eater. But we could try. Nah, hold off. Yeah. See what everybody else is up to? Okay. Alright. Control room. <clears throat> so these are our unlocks, right? That we get to un that we get to set up. Um we've spent a lot of money, you know, obviously building stuff. Expedition map. Island navigation. All right, let's go ahead and get some contracts. Science, entertainment, which one? Um, Security, science. Ah, Dr. Dua. This is our new director of operations. I'm aware, Cabot. I'm Dr. Dua. I run the science division of our operation. Okay, you're going to need to build your reputation in the science division. Not easy with me around, but you'll manage. That means managing our dinosaur population and seeing that they are flourishing. Mm, nothing like managing something with dinosaurs like drinking a good cup of coffee. All right. Use the expedition center to send a dig team on an expedition and unearth a small or medium herbivore. Hey, like Struthiomimus, huh? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do Dinosaur Dig Up. And we'll go ahead and go to the Expedition Room. Right there. Look at that. Struthiomimus, Edmontosaurus, and Triceratops all together. So we'll go ahead and Good. send a big team Your out. first Expedition team is out. They'll bring back what they find to there the fossil the helicopter. center for extraction. All right. Your job is simple, really. Create dinosaurs which attract visitors to your facilities, brings in capital, money, huh? 
Which means you can do more research to build better facilities and create more dinosaurs, and there you go. A circle of life, development and resources, nature and commerce. See? Simple. Alright. So you want to do another contract? Yeah. Oh, less than one minute. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and check out the research center. The research center lets you improve your park in various exciting ways. New buildings, upgrades, and more await. Research allows you to improve and expand multiple aspects of your facility. <clears throat> you can research new and improved genes to modify your dinosaurs. And some items have division reputation requirements that need to be met before they become available. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and do some research. What I want to do is let's get that genetic research done, right? Intuitive learning, intensive repair, immuno response, right? Shark DNA to provide resistance to diseases, including cancer. Intuitive learning, crow DNA makes him smart, like a crow. That could be bad. They could learn how to escape. Intensive repair. Anoli lizard DNA regrows lost tails, so it helps him heal faster. Hey, kitty. Uh, profit per minute, we're in the negative still. That is because of power, usage, wastage. Entertainment? Science? Entertainment? Remember, the show must go on. This contract makes that possible. Extract new DNA in the fossil center to increase a dinosaur genome to at least 50%. So we can definitely take that one home. <clears throat> it's kind of our goal anyway. Oh, oh, oh! You should extract yes. genomes from fossils that have been collected inside your fossil center. That will increase the amount of viable data you have to create dinosaurs. Income. You made that look easier than it was. Extract fossils to build genomes. Eat the fossil viable center genomes lets you extract dinosaurs. DNA from fossils and amber in order to create new dinosaur genomes. Exciting! Expeditions also bring back extra finds. Alright, here we go. Ooh. I've got an interesting you opportunity for you to though? consider. It will allow us to work try. together to create life. Pure life. If you've been listening to Dr. Malcolm, then you know how important this is to us. And to me. Let's go ahead and get that Triceratops up. I knew you were my kind of person. Inquisitive, driven, and I knew you couldn't resist this opportunity. The amber is Triceratops. Let's get started. How awesome is that? And then Together, we can create a more authentic Edmontosaurus. version of our dinosaurs. That and then means we'll a go ahead genome. And, and I think get... you are up to the challenge. Don't disappoint. The, the three Struthio minus as well. So we're focusing on the Triceratops first, since we have a mission for a million dollars. Huh. Millions! <laughs> <clears throat> okay, let's go back to the research center, or should we send out the expedition from the ground?
said the expedition came out? Yeah. Okay. We're just going to go ahead and do the lance formation again. And then, so we'll come over here, research center. View research. Uh, building upgrades, maybe? Ah, there it is. Increase the success rate of your dinosaur. Let's go ahead and do that, right? Oh! We are making great strides so far. I believe I may be on the cusp so of something So we have three minutes wondrous. remaining. And I have you to thank, at least in part, for where I find myself. Now we need to incubate, hatch, and house our dinosaur. Then we will know if our efforts will have been worth it. I wasn't sure about this one, but you delivered. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and go back to the control room, grab some new contracts. Security. We have a Triceratops coming. Security. Uh, this is Lambert, head of security. Yours, theirs, and mine. Welcome to the islands. So here's our basic conundrum. We want to keep our animals under control while simultaneously encouraging instinctive behaviors because these animals have potential as combatants. Look, everyone's fear object, myself included, is to have these animals running free and loose in the park. But we can't exploit them globally without taking some chances. So, we get 100,000 back for building an ACU center. Obviously, building the ACU center is going to cost some money, but that's okay because we have the Triceratops genome in the works. Right. I'm thinking... So we want the ACU center able to react diligently to any location within our park. So, since we know that the entertainment division wants a meat eater, I was thinking we can put the meat eater like somewhere over here, right? So I was thinking the ACU center could probably do us some good in here. Maybe? What do you think? So like if we put it right there, it's within the power of that substation. Alright. Because that's going to cost a pretty penny. Um, let's go ahead and check out the fossil center, see if we have anything to sell. Uh -huh, uh -huh. See, see, sell it. You've done good work in the past. That's why I know you are perfect <clears throat> for this contract. Successfully incubate a small herbivore for 125000 So it's a 90000 profit if we make a sweet deal minus. I think that's worth it. This opportunity is too good to pass up. I know, it sounds like I always say that, but I always mean it. All right. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and uh, see if the upgrades are done. Hemi will come out more often. Hemi is our cat. He's a big, fat, lazy, tabby cat. Huh. He wants up? Yeah, he wants up. Say hi, Hemi. Her. I guess this means <clears throat> congratulations are in order. All right, uh, research, center, yes, success rate, we got it. So now we can come over here, increase that by 10%, not bad. <clears throat> All right, you ready? So I say we make profit now, right? 
go ahead and incubate another Struthiomimus, which as you can see, plus 30% viability on top of 76% is an over 100% chance that he'll be okay. Which he still might not be, but, you know, I don't... So we'll go ahead and incubate him, and that will pay for another expedition trip. You want to just go strictly for Triceratops this time? Okay. <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and grab another contract, right? Who do you want to get a contract with this time? Security, entertainment. You made this look easy. Entertainment again? Just be sure you don't make the okay. rest of us look bad. I'm kidding. Who could possibly make me look bad? I mean, come on. Entertainment again? You know, entertainment has the highest rating. And it's making these uh, reputations go down. So do we want to increase one of theirs instead? Okay, who? Um, science? The science of breeding dinosaurs or security? Security. Security? Okay. It's a dangerous world. And this place makes it more dangerous. Ooh, we get 150,000? This can help us with security here. For the ranger team to take a photo. We'll go ahead and hold on to that. Intelligence is an essential part of security. We got a contract for photography that's build. just become available. Give it a once over. That means we need to build a ranger team. Let's go ahead and let our other. So, what should we name him? Chicken? Turkey leg? Interesting. Another Chicken? dinosaur that furthers the case of a direct linkage to our modern bird. Chicken! Okay. Um. Yep, there's Renfair Turkey Leg. Oh, his health is low. Oh, he's hungry. <laughs> You know what? Let's see if we can get a contract for... Screw it. There's gotta be... Here we go. So, I was thinking we could put a viewing station right here. Would that be cool? Because look, if you take a look, we have room. We have the expedition center and then the incubation. We can put a viewing thing over here. So let's go ahead and build that since he's hungry. Poor guy. Poor Renfair turkey leg, we forgot to feed him! Um, and you know what? While we're here... What do you think? I think that would be actually pretty cool. Oh, we're out of power. It looks like you've run out of power. That's not good. Build more power stations or increase your output. <sighs> power, power, small power. Oh my god. It's so expensive. Oh. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll get right on that. There is blue. Come up there. And then... Let's build the path, right? Okay. Okay, and then we need a path for our viewing gallery. 
So I'm basically kind of counting on this viewing gallery making us some money. There we go. How's that look? I think that'll work. Okay. Let's go ahead and request a new contract. An opportunity Science. has presented itself. Acquire reduced upkeep upgrade. I'm gonna go ahead and decline that. Because it's gonna cost us more money than it's worth. Okay. So we'll go ahead and uh, there we go. So we have power to everything. Okay, ACU's back online. Let's go ahead and see the fossil center, see if we have any kind of income here. Yep, we do. We have some silver. Some more Triceratops genome. And another. Those two combined with our research should give us a very high probability of getting that Triceratops to uh, health. So, there are some people now. Is the big bus coming out of there? Like, poof, we're here. You know what? How much is this? 170,000. Mental note, we're probably going to build a fast food place next. Okay? okay. Remind me, okay? okay. We'll, we'll put it somewhere in here in the central location. Since, remember, we're going to be putting the Predator somewhere, I don't know. We might just give him this area. Mm. Would that be kind of cool? Yeah. We could do that. Or we could go over here next to the ACU, maybe put a hotel and stuff, you know, some stores in here. Yeah, let's see how big the stores are. Yeah, see, the stores are kind of small. That one wasn't too big. Uh, let's see. Hotel's kind of... Huge. Well, that's okay because it can fit down there and then uh, let's see yeah because we have gift shop hotel and fast food and we will put the emergency shelter right near uh, in between the triceratops and the ceratosaurus right that way people can easily get there without getting into too much trouble all right, so we definitely need. Let's see if we can get another contract, right? Yeah. Which one? Me. I picked, and it was terrible. So now it's your turn. Um, science. Science. Yeah. Um, I want to take this contract. Use the expedition center to unearth to a small or medium Correct. herbivore. So we'll get fifty thousand profit from this because it costs about seventy-five thousand to go out. We can do that. Let's go ahead and view the expedition map. Go right back there, huh? Yeah. Go there, or do, do you want to try a different location? Um, a different location. Horseshoe in Canada, or Dinosaur Park? Dinosaur Park. More Struthiomimus, or Edmontosaurus? Struthiomimus? Um, Just go ahead and get that to 100, or... Edmontosaurus. Edmontosaurus? Okay, off he goes. We are definitely going to need that ranger team here, though. Huh. Yeah. What I'm kind of trying to do is I'm hoping for a contract for it. And right now, I just want to... Yep. Okay. They're done. So now... Let's go back here. You ready? Yeah. He should be over 100% now. Do we want to modify the genome at all? Let's see. Let's see what options we have. Yeah, okay. Tooth hardness increases his rating by 5% and his attack. That's not good. It's a triceratop. I don't need it tearing apart the park. Yeah. Increases skin toughness, increases its defense, increases its rating. Could apply that one, that one's fairly cheap. Look, it's only about 9,000, but it 
increases his rating by 5%. This is going to be the star of our park tonight. What do you think? Should, should we go ahead and give him this? Just to get his rating up a little bit more? Yeah. It's going to increase his attack, though. Or, you know, we can give him a paint drop, which increases his rating by a ton, but it lowers his viability to below 100. Okay, so it's your fault if this doesn't work. He's more than a quarter million dollars, okay? Let's see what let's see what happens though. Because I I'd, I'd love to get our triceratops. Take this contract. It's a good one for both of us. Yeah, we can take a contract for a successful expedition, huh? Because we already have an expedition anyway. <laughs> And it counted! <laughs> Alright, how'd we do? Yes, this is exactly what we needed. What? Well done completing this? that contract. What is that? Skin impressions. Oh, that's really cool. Wow. Keep this up and the sky's the limit. And there we go, Edmontosaurus. Whoa! Here we go. Your rep is off the charts. So you're getting a reward for the entertainment division for your work on Isla Man and Saros. Ooh, we just unlocked something. We unlocked a savanna. What the heck is a savanna? Edmontosaurus is now ready. Engine database? Hmm. Close shot. <gasps> he made it! He made it. What are we gonna What are we gonna name him? What are we gonna name him? The star of our show. I mean, it's a Triceratops. Pointy. Right? That's dumb. You need to come up with something better. Ah. Uh, trike. Sarah. Sarah, like from Land Before Time. Right? Get it? Get it? Sarah? Here she comes. How awesome is that? We got a Triceratops! And you know what? Our new specimens... Sorry, dinosaurs. Are meeting expectations, but we want them to thrive. That's your next assignment. Making sure our specimens are properly cared for. In other words, dinosaur welfare. The difference with dinosaurs is that they have no point of reference to understand humans, so don't expect much in the way of thank yous. So you know what? I think we're going to end this one here. I've been monitoring what you've been up to with great interest. And I'm a little disappointed that Dr. Dua came to you for this assignment instead of bringing me into the loop as she should have done. I'll discuss this with her later. All right. What should we name it? Dinosaurs! Dinotopia. Dinosaur land. I think I spelled that right. I, did, I don't think I spelled that right. No, I spelled it right. 
All right. Well, so far we have our Triceratops running amok. We have a viewing center, so we can hopefully make some profits off of that. Um, we need to construct an operational ranger station. Uh, we're working on the genome on the Triceratops, and we're researching, it looks like, some medical vaccinations for our dinosaurs. And we have our uh, emergency response team. We have Expedition Center going strong. I, I think we're doing good. We're still over a million bucks. You know, maybe now that we have a Triceratops, we can start sitting in the black, making some money. Uh, be sure to check us out. We're going to keep playing. Don't forget the fast food. Yep, and we'll definitely do a fast food restaurant, put in an In-N-Out burger on the next episode. Catch you guys around.